Hey guys, welcome back to World of Warplanes with your host Rune. So we are still in the skies of Albion conflict. So we're going to go ahead and take out the F4U1. I haven't really flown her in a very long time, uh, recorded-wise. Uh, mainly because we don't have the... Oh, hold on. The mastery button yet because of the fact that we don't have our tiger yet. But we are actually a lot closer in our experience here to unlock the tiger than we are in our um, heavy. So, and plus I love the Corsairs, so I don't necessarily mind going in this thing. So we're going to go, we're going to do some matches in this guy. And I wonder if we have um, the ability to unlock the uh, F7F from the F4U gameplay today. That's going to be kind of an interesting thing. So let me know what other kind of planes you guys like, and then um, we can try to correspond and do some um, some co-op. That'd be kind of really cool. It kind of depends. I don't have that. Um, I don't have that many German planes right now. I have a bomber that's tier five. This guy actually right there, and I have my tier four heavy. The BF-110 Bravo, I think, if I, memory serves me correctly. Um, but I don't have a lot of Axis um, planes, but I do know that a lot of you guys like to fly uh, the German planes and the Japanese lines as well. And even in the Russian lines, even Robert, I think Robert was grinding the Yak Tree and stuff. I wonder how he's doing on that one. I haven't really seen Robert in a minute. I think he was doing real life stuff. Um, and then we're going to try to coordinate again, kind of like little channel update stuff while we're loading, guys. <laughs> We've got, um, you know, every Friday and Saturday I want to instill this mindset of cooperation and co-op. So um, there is a link in the description down there on Discord that you guys can come and join us whenever you want. And come hang out and talk in um, general chat. Um, there's not that many of us right now. Um, and... Otaku and I are hit or miss, you know, being busy or sleeping or working or, you know what I mean? But um, it is a really cool place, a really good forum to hang out and chat and, like, share pictures, screenshots of, like, your your in-game results or, you know, you guys want to talk about, you know, different kind of games or the same kind of games or strategies that you guys use, what kind of planes you guys use. You guys can all get on that Discord and feel free to, you know, chat in there. That'd be kind of a really cool thing. And we're loading one day while well, I have my coffee. Okay, so we're on the Asian border frontline map, which means we got a command center in the middle. Yay. <laughs> Two garrisons and an air base. We are top tier, it looks like. And it looks like no enemy players. This guy, maybe? This guy? Nope. I'm right-clicking, guys, just so you're aware. So we're still taking forever to load, so everybody else is loaded. I'm going to communicate to that place, because that's where we're going as soon as we load in one day. I do kind of miss the, the bombs. I did research the rockets on this plane. Um, I'm not sure if I like the rockets. They're good defense when it comes to heavies coming at you, in my opinion, because I like the, like the rocket to the face. But... Uh, I don't know. You are, approaching the area of are we going to load? Operations. Oh, man. I see, like, we're, like, right on top of it. Rocket, 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 rocket. Rocket, 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 rocket. Yay! We did things. Oh, man. Okay, we'll activate our boost. Look at all those ground pounders. Look at all of those ground pounders, dude. Whoa. So many ground pounders. Let's come up. Hit this guy. Oh yeah, you're going down, dude. Turn around. Large enemy force is attacking the command center. Hit this guy, hit him hard. Okay. Woo! 
Let's get this guy. Got him. Nice. All right, with that, guys, we have captured the command center. Now we're going to play Ring Around a Rosie with this guy. There we go. Let's do the airfield. Oh, let's defend our, our position here. Are you coming around? Or are you turning around? You're turning around. Okay, well, we'll climb. We'll gain altitude. Let's see if we can line up for... Yeah, I'm shooting you. Hello. <laughs> oh, they took it right as we killed him. That's unfortunate. Well, that's okay. We'll kill these guys. Get it. Oh, 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 oh. Gotcha. All right, let's get back on the point. Uh, let's not. Let's actually kill that. Okay. All right, our friendly's there. Oh, he's down. Oh, okay. I'm going for a ground target here. Woo! Hold up. Let's shoot this AA for our allies. As it is super annoying to get shot by that stuff. Uh, let's pull up here. One day we'll shoot this guy. I promise. There. <laughs> oh, man. That took a minute. Whee! Yeah, we're getting repaired. I love how, like, it's more instant right now. I don't know if that was, like, a change that needed to happen or something like that on a patch. But, like, for a while, sometimes you get locked out on repair, guys. So, all right. Anyway... Enough of silent treatment. We're just going to get in focus mode over here. Um, so, yeah, um, we're going to do some more co-ops and stuff with Roland. Um, he plays tanks, too. He's actually currently online in tanks as we speak. Um, <laughs> so I, I figured to let him do that because co-op, I want to I wanna instill kind of like a planned schedule and where we're going to have co-op videos and everything on Friday and Saturday. That doesn't necessarily mean... That if I have um, if I have some extra time, we'll totally you know group up during the regular week. Uh, that'd be cool, uh, but we might not record that for. Uh, uh oh. There we go. Roland taught me a trick. If you knife them with your wing, you won't instantly die, and they'll take damage. So that's that's a good trick, Roland. Roland saving my butt there. Um, with giving me a trip. What's interesting is, like, my wing doesn't, like, get ripped off. You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know, guys. Here's a bomber. He needs to die. I also need to level up this commander to, you know, get a better aiming reticule because we do not have the best aiming that we could have. Oh, man. Are we stalling? We are stalling. Man. Okay. I did not realize that until, like, just now. Um, let's see. Where are our enemies? Ground pounders. All right. We're coming in. I wonder if we can... The explosion's going to kill him? No. I thought the explosion was going to kill him. Whoa! Ninja. That's me, ninjaing. <laughs> ninjaing all day. Ninja, ninja them still those those kills. Let's Keep kill this guy. 
Whoa, shot him up. All right, where are we going? Up. Oh, yeah. We're going up. Got to help our P-40 guy. He looks like he's in trouble. You're in trouble, bro. I'm coming. I'm trying. No. There's no way to break. No. I will avenge you. I promise. Be avenged. Oh man. Okay. I'm coming for you, Brohim. All right, bro potato chip. Get it. Can I one day, one day when my stuff's not overheated. There we go. Complete control of the sky. Oh, complete control of the sky. All right, where are we going? This, oh, we won! I'm proud of you, pilot. I was gonna kill that guy. <laughs> wow, we made fourteen thousand even. That's <laughs> that's weird. That's really I've never got like an even number before, guys. That's that's a hmm hmm hmm. I don't know what to call this episode since we're not necessarily in our P thirty eight F grinding the heavy line, but we are playing. Our Corsair to then unlock the F7F. We might just call it flying this plane. <laughs> you know? Alright, so we shot down 11. Help with 4. Helped capture 2 targets. Did a couple of thousand worth of ground targets. Not really nothing of, of special note there. Um, this was our team. It looked like we had um, 5 people on our team versus bots. So everybody did really good. Good job, everybody. And that was our 14,000 even. Weird. <laughs> Which is good, because the more combat points you get, the more um, money you get. So let's just take a look real quick before we go out again. We're at 19,000 there, and I think we need... Okay, yeah, man, we have, we have a ways to go regardless. So let's just get to it. We'll probably do, you know, three, three matches maybe, so we got two more. Two more. See, the issue with having longer than 30 minute videos on YouTube, it just takes forever to upload. Like 30, um, 30 minute to 45 minute episodes, guys, takes like anywhere between an hour and a half to two and a half hours of uploading. And that's not including after uploading the processing time it takes to then be able to fully publish. So it's definitely a time investment when you do longer videos like when you just do like singular match videos and stuff like that i mean it's like a 30 45 minute upload and like a five minute processing time and stuff like that so for those that you aren't or for those that do not um know or are not aware that the the youtube up uploading time is just um it can get kind of ridiculous so um i can't imagine some of the guys some of the guys that i watch they do like youtube streams and then they'll they'll put up you know for the reg for the community if you've missed the stream right that they, they put up the video of the stream and that's like a three hour long video I don't know <laughs> I would not want to sit there and look at that wait timer because <laughs> three hours is insane like a 45 50 minute video is like two and a half hours so think about that like wow it's just like hmm I don't know I don't know or unless since it was streamed on YouTube, would that mean if you use the YouTube software stuff, it's more instant? Or if you captured it, because I have a third-party actioning, uh, I have Action, which is my captioning software. So, like, that's that's a, a, a second or a, a separate uh, piece of software, not YouTube. Does that make sense? I don't know. I'm jibber-jabbering. Anyway, we're on Scorching Sands, leading edge map. We are top tier. We've got one mining plant and two airstrips to worry about. Um, and it looks like all of these guys are bots. Pilots, get ready for action. Let's go. Which, you know. Okay. You are approaching the area of combat Whichever. Operation. I think I'm going to launch my... I don't know. I don't know what we want to do. Let's kind of like wait here. I'm going to get rid of my... 
Hmm. You know what we're going to do? I'm going to shoot all of the AA. That's what I'm going to do. Ooh, we are awfully close, my friend. Oh, and we got ground pounders. Coming in hot and heavy. Let's try to turn. Large enemy force spotted over the airfield. Oh, man. Gotcha. Okay. Let's try to shoot this guy down. Yeah. Hmm. I'm not seeing an advantage here. All right. I helped get that. Oh, oh thank God that thing exploded. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, no. Look at the swarm. I got you, Heavy. Stay alive. Red Shock Trooper, I'm coming, dude. Oh, dude, you are. You are in the sea of red. Let's see if I can... No, there's... Uh, uh, uh. That guy rammed me. Uh, no! No! <laughs> oh yeah, you didn't think I'd turn around to shoot you, did I? Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> we are so boned, guys. We have seven health. We're stalling. There's no way. There we go. <laughs> I was going to say, if we survive that, I was going to be like, holy crap, guys. Holy crap. All right. Prepare for spawning. All right, so we're going to go defend our mining plant. The enemy is trying to capture the plant. Don't let them I'm, do I'm, it. I'm going. We got to get up there. Oh, okay, good. That heavy destroyed their stuff. We've got guys defending our point over there. Um, these guys are all up here. I'm going to help get this guy. Ooh, ooh. Why'd I just get peppered? Why'd I just get peppered? Okay, we helped kill that guy. Oh, oh, what? I didn't even see you there. Seriously? Yak flew right into me. I didn't even... Man, really, Yak? Ugh, that sucked. Well, sorry, Yak guy, but, you know, I was there. <laughs> oh, man, I can't believe it that happened. That That's really upsetting. I don't like running into... Look, it happened again! Seriously? <laughs> what the... Ugh. Really, guys? Running into me. <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> uh, the salt is real. That was twice in the same match to where an ally teammate ran into us. And we weren't even trying, or we weren't even, like, really close. Let's check out the view screen here. So we got four kills, two assists. Very low game because we ended up capping out super early. So let's take a look at this. So where is this? Okay, so that was an NPC. And then who was the other guy that ran into us? Somebody else. I think it was another NPC. That makes more sense to me now. No, I'm less infuriated. <laughs> oh, man. That just irks me, man. When you get... To, to no fault of your own, man. To no, it's kind of like when you're sniping and, and a teammate like walks in front of your muzzle. 
this guy like really guy like i'm i'm shooting here don't mind me or anything just trying to you know cover our team <laughs> man all right guys well hey i'm gonna bring you guys back when we load into the game because this might take a minute all right we are back and surprisingly an alpine gambit collision map it's not normally something that you see in a tier six game but you know what that's fine. Actually, you know what? Come to think of it, I think in, like, when me and Tyronin were playing uh, together in our co-op thing, we were on Alpine Gambit, and we were in, like, sixes or something like that. I can't remember. I can't remember. we got a military base to worry about, two garrisons, two airstrips. We've got um, only two tier sevens. And let's just get in there one day. So... Let's go into the fighting stance of the military base and stay there. That's going to be like our dogfight zone. I'm going to go in there and let loose the dogs of missiles and or war. Whichever. Rocket. 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 Really? I missed. We are losing the military base. Uh, there are no, we're too not. many enemy aircraft. Hey, 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 hey. Holy crap. What are you guys all doing? And why can't I hit you? Ah! We're gonna have to pull off, we're too close. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Yet again, we're met with, like, a crap ton of, uh, of these guys. Let's let's all rock it, like, right there. See if we hit anybody. No? None of our explosions. It was like, no, dude. There's one. Scratch one bad guy! Okay, we took it. Ooh! 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 Whoa, we gotta dodge him a little bit. Coming around for another pass. Do 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 do. I wanna shoot your engines out. There we go. I shot his engine out. I'm shooting you. I'm really kinda surprised that there's no like fighters. I don't know what's happening. I don't know. Are you trying to dodge me? I don't really see why you're trying to dodge me. There, hey, look! Because I killed him, I capped the point. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, maybe there's like a whole bunch of guys over here? Let's go poke. Poke, poke, poke. Oh, this might be like the most terriblest mistake ever. Most terriblest. Oh. There's an air defense guy. And one multi-roll guy. Okay, I'm going to ignore him to kill this guy. Ha! Reset it! No, 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 no! No! <laughs> Simon, is Simon a player? I don't know if Simon's a player. Hold on. Uh, nope. Not a player. Let's go here. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> I don't know what possessed me to go and pick a fight all by my lonesome, but I did. And it wasn't that bad. I mean, we kind of reset it, and then it kind of didn't matter because then we died. <laughs> but hey, that's okay, right? Some of these matches are kind of frustrating because there's no... It's... There, there's just... There's no players... I want to fight against players in this game. Now, in my video that's going to happen beforehand, or soon, is uh, put up a video of uh, us in a carrier, the USS Saipan, which is a Tier 7 premium United States Navy vessel. And I showcase both the different loadouts it has, the Strike and the... Um, the well it's not really a strike because or well it's i mean it's considered a strike because it's got two die uh two 
torpedo bombers, and then two fighter squadron wings, doohickey, doohickey things. Um, but there's then then there's the anti-air, which is the three fighter squadrons and one really large dive bomber squadron, which is super cool too. So um, we take out both of those in co-op matches because I have a low tier commander right now in the Saipan, and I wanted to just uh, kind of showcase the abilities of the plane or of the uh, of the vessel without. Um, feeling such like a scrub. And what I might end up doing for solo gameplay carrier stuff like that is I might... Oh, you dodged! Oh, that sucks. <laughs> I wanted to rocket you in the, in the, in the butt. Hold on. Rocket? No, that didn't happen. Okay, well, let's try to, let's try to make it happen to this guy. Oh, it's not gonna happen to you. He's an angle. I'm coming for you, my pretty. Well, that didn't work. He's gonna drop missiles and stuff too. This is like one of those, like, we are just going to attack. Oh, wait, hold on. Nope, I missed! Man, I suck at missiles. I suck at missiles! But you know what? I don't know. We're protecting our military base. There's not a lot of dogfights going on. Like, I don't know. It's that whole... That whole lack of uh, enemy players on the other side. That's really unfortunate, guys. Like, look at that. Zero? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, what we were talking about is... Um, I did a carrier video to where I showcased both the different module loadouts um of the saipan it was it was fun uh we got some victories out of it and i got to showcase um some of the different concepts now by no means am i an expert at at a carrier i do not have a tier 10 i do not i do not know all the ins and the outs and i'm not that great um but i'm not that terrible either i'm kind of like that average joe kind of player when it comes to a carrier just mainly because i haven't played them in such a long time and now I'm getting back into the swing of things. So we ended up getting a point, which is what I wanted. So we got nine kills there and then three capture points there, which is great. Um, and let's take a look at this. So these were players. Good job, you. Our enemy team is a whole bunch of bots, so we don't have to worry about that. Um, we didn't really get any accolades either. That's kind of, like, unfortunate. Let's get our marksman here. And... Oops. Let's do another one. So yeah, it was a fun. It was a fun episode. I got a little. I got a little too focused at times, but I mean that's kind of like the carrier like way sometimes is like when you're trying to do everything at once and also do commentary, it gets really distracting. So what I might end up doing is I kind of just I, I I tried to lay this out or talked about this at the end of that episode is if I'm doing single player stuff in the warships and I'm doing carriers. What I might end up doing is I might actually just, like, record the episode without me talking and just kind of, like, um, then do the match, right? And then after the match, I do, like, post-commentary to where then, then me and you look over it and then I, I do some talking points. I, I you know, we, we do that kind of a thing and maybe that would allow for a much more cleaner, concise uh, commentary chatter when it comes to um, the carrier gameplay. So let me know if you guys like that idea or do you guys prefer me doing like kind of everything live in a sense. I know I don't have like a can uh, like a like a uh, like a, a head cam or anything like that, but um, I do do everything kind of like in a one-shot recording kind of thing because I do think that mistakes are kind of fun that we can all like laugh at and everything. It's not really a big deal to me in that regard. So, But I did want your guys' opinion about post-commentary videos and stuff so then I can start pushing out um, some single-player stuff and then later talking about it, especially maybe during Random Thought Thursdays that I haven't done in quite some time to where we do like news updates on the channel and like all the other different stuff. I've been kind of trying to just incorporate that kind of content within um, some of these videos like this one. 
So we're on the Archipelago Decisive Blow map now, where we've got a command center, and then garrison, and then Ford airstrip. So we have to immediately capture these two to our left and our right here, and pull off a victory. It's looking like we're running out of players, though. That's a player. That's a player. That's a player. So I guess it's really like we only have five. All right, so we're going to divide and conquer. Let's go. And uh, I guess like that, that's a that's a normal thing. Um, that we have like five players per team. Oh, okay, we cap we, we took that. Okay, now let's now let's dogfight. Uh, where are we going? Here? Let's shoot this guy one day. Okay, got that guy. Coming back around. We don't want to stall out. We've taken control of the airfield. Oh, they're gone. Okay, so we capped him. Now we got to defend him. Speaking of defense. Yeah, I guess um, like that's like a standard quote is um, five human players to can i hit you good grief <laughs> um five five players um total like there's five players and then everybody else are bots which is really interesting to me um but okay so we got our bow finder our bow fighter is going to be trying to take out the dive um those bombers and then what we're going to do is we are going to try to take out these guys one day, if I have better aim. Oh, he's not even, like, in my AO here. Oh, no. And I'm going to stall out because I can't. I have, like, no altitude adjustment right now. Oh, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> Sitting duck. Sitting duck. Let's get some altitude. Man, that was terrible. That was a bad choice on my on my part. Try to get that guy. Oh, man. There's another guy right here. Okay, he got that guy. Oh, oh. Let's try to get him. Shredding him with these cannons. Got him. Ooh. Oh, that was going to be deadly. Oh, no. More deadly are those guys. Oh, <laughs> that was pretty cool. But scary at the same time. I'm on your six now, dude. Oh, man. Okay. This guy wants a piece of us. All right. I will play this game. There. Alright, we're getting over the point. I'm diving. I'm going to try to take out this guy. Okay. Okay. Turn in. Oh, uh, yeah, nice. Oh, I need a repair. Ooh. Ooh. Let's try to get this guy one day. There we go. Got him. Oh, no, no, no. No. <laughs> oh, jeez. That guy.
Okay. Whew. I'm running out of I'm running out of life, guys. <laughs> this is insane. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Wasn't paying attention. Oh, I barely saw that guy. This might be bad. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> I tried to get him. I tried to get him. Let's respawn here so we can kill this guy and not have an issue here. We got still supremacy, which is great. I mean, we, we lost that for a minute. But uh, we got it back. Try to before we win. Yeah! Before we won. <laughs> oh man! All right. Well, is that guy a player? No. See, that's just so weird. And then I'll show you, like, when we get back to the screen here. There's only going to be five of us on the allies team, so that's like really kind of. You know, I really wish that a lot more people played in this, like, conflict on the enemy side and then, like, on our side. Let's take a look here. So we got 12. We shot, um, help one, two capture points. All that fun jazz. Let's go look at the team score. See, there's me, right? One, two, three, four, five. And it's been like that in every single match. And it's been like that since this guy is the Alveon, like, thing. Like, I've only noticed only like a couple of matches to where we've had like more than just five people like total and that's kind of unfortunate it kind of like you know this is like a really cool event you know like if i had more axes planes we would do more axis stuff maybe you know oh excuse me you know what you know what tomorrow tomorrow's video we are going to be in our heavy bf 110 bravo on the axis side fighting the allies because this is actually relatively close you know, we can try to, we can try to, you know, at least, and plus, we need to grind it, too. Um, because, let's see, here is our BF-110 right now. Yeah, see, we have, we have the, we got to get the bombs still, and then we got to get into the BF-110E. You know, we, and it's, she's still, like, almost, you know, we got, like, no equipment on her, you know, she's, she needs a lot of work, right? We also need a lot of silver guys because we're trying to get into the Thunder Jet, the Tier 9 version of the XP-72. And there's just so much to do, guys. So much to do. So little time. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so, long, uh, so much for coming along with me in this adventure, trying to do some experience grinding. We got 28,448. So we have, what, like 12,000? No, no, we have, we have a lot more than that, right? Required is 29,900 left. So we are about halfway there. That's not including, you know, all that stuff. So we're halfway there. And I like playing in my in my Corsair. So we might just stick with this route here. Or we might, you know, we might just, you know, do this one too. I'm not too sure, guys. Is it like a shared thing? Because see, required is 29... Requires 44,000. And we have 28,000. So shouldn't that number be a little less? Right? Because 28 plus 29 is like 50 something. You know what, guys? It doesn't matter. <laughs> you guys have a great day. Uh, see you later. Take care. Peace.